Okay, it's 12.30, about 12.30, Nina's original doctor went on vacation. The new doctor, I just got done going poop because I don't want to flush the toilet here. The new doctor is going to be the one that delivers. He's dilated to about a five and having the normal contractions. Like I said, it's 12.30, and she's sitting on the ball, getting Roman to come down, because he's still up a little bit high. But the new nurse came in and offered some different plans, and we told her how it was, didn't we, honey? Yeah, you sure did, honey. Damn right. <laughs> she's all wild. Inconvenience the anesthesiologist and the doctor, you know. He doesn't want to wake up every time. And she got deboed. But, anyways, we're sticking to the original plan. Roman's just a little bit higher, but I could tell just by feeling her belly that from doing that, he's coming down. And Nina's making it through her contractions nice and easy, even though they hurt her really bad. She's doing good. And the ball is just, and gravity's bringing him down. And last I checked, you were dilated at a five, honey? A little bit more than a five. A little bit more than a five. So. So the plan is to get him lowered into a seven before we do any sort of epidural. It's 12.30. Low, we're going to lower him. Get dilated to a seven. Uh, hit the epidural, and he's coming out. Oh, little motherfucker. He's getting his little ass out of there. I already got a list of chores for him to do, putting us through all this. Are you doing good, babe? We've been keeping him nice and massaged. And if I give her Lots of kisses, it makes her feel better, doesn't it, honey? <laughs> yeah. It makes them easier. So I'm just going to get back to my massaging. And she's going to get back to her bouncing and bring Roman down. And when we get closer, I'll give you another update. Roger it out.